So you press B A A B B A Y X. Pause. Hold tight the control like this for three seconds. And pause again. And boom, ladies and gentlemen, the game is here. FIFA 20 Hazard is the cover. I mean, the designer's tag is still on it because it's like a beta mode, not fully finished. But hey, I'll take it and I'll play it. Y'all enjoy FIFA 19. I'm in the future. If you want coins, some FIFA coins, just go to FIFA coin and use more for FIFA coins. If you want coins, some FIFA coins. Just go to FIFA coin and use mom for FIFA coin. Yo, ladies and gentlemen, this is your boy Momo. Welcome to my channel for <laughs> probably one of the biggest videos of the year. I do this every single year. You guys that have been subscribed to me for a while now, you know how this goes, okay? I don't need to explain myself too much. Every year, when we're getting close to the end of the calendar year of the current FIFA, we go through concept cards, concept designs, concept menu, concept game modes that we want to see in the future FIFA. And this time, we're going to talk about FIFA 20, ladies and gentlemen. If you're saying FIFA 20, hit the like button. I am. I'm already tired of FIFA 19, okay? Too many L's. It's time to win a little bit. So FIFA 20 may be the year. Before we get into this video, I want you guys to rate FIFA 19 from 0 to 10, okay? I'll give it a 7, bro. I mean, content-wise, things was dope, but at the same time, the gameplay was a little bit weird. And I was completely lost in this in this game. Like I didn't know what to offer you guys as viewers. Completely lost. So I'll give it a six or seven. So we're starting up with FIFA 20 concept, ladies and gentlemen. The start screen. Okay, as you saw it in the beginning of the video. Uh, Mr. Don Dummy Drexel. I hope I'm not bushing your name, but it's hazard that he put on the cover. FIFA 20. One mistake though. Put 2018 electronic arts. It's supposed to be 2019. I think so. If I'm not mistaken. Apart from that, I like it though, the red, the stadium lights, and the, the, the jersey of Hazard, which is red, of course, the Red Devils from Belgium. It's really nice. If this is the official star screen of FIFA 20, I don't think people are going to complain, but it looks beautiful. So if this is the star screen, that means Hazard is the cover. I really doubt it, but at the same time, it's possible. We had Bruce be the cover uh, in FIFA 17, as you can see over here. So I don't think Hazard is too impossible. You get me? Next, we have a kit creator. Okay, concept. As you can see over here, uh, this has been done by Mr. O Graphics, if I'm not mistaken. The kit creator is not bad at all, ladies and gentlemen. You could create your own kit. Since when we be asking for this, I mean, maybe in Ultimate Team, they can do it because uh, whatever reason, they might miss out on some money or whatever. Okay, we get it. But at least, career mode? You know, why not? Why not? You can see, he actually went into all the details, bro. All the details, the patterns, the number, the crest, the color, and the patterns color. Right, he did a good job. Okay, we have the top, two tops, the short socks, and the boots. That's the preview of what he got so far. Hey, I like it. If my United really start wearing that, maybe without the, the dots, but at the same time, the dots, they make you have this galactic, you know, look. I will take it, okay? What do you guys think about uh, kit creators in FIFA 20? I will take it. Oh, hold on guys, before we get deeper, deeper in this video, I have something to show you guys. If you're a fan of football, I'm pretty sure you are, that's why you play FIFA. You need to have this app called One Football, ladies and gentlemen. They are the best app in the world. Like, I'm not even joking. When it comes to knowing everything related to football, a uh, beautiful sport, okay? Injuries, transfer, gameplay highlights, match facts, lineups, scores, fixtures. Oh my god, they have everything. What I like about them is that they give you news. We're talking about news. You don't need to turn on your TV, ladies and gentlemen. Over here, we started with Real Madrid close to winning the race to sign Luka Jovic. Well, when Real Madrid start chasing you, it's a wrap. Your club cries because they're gonna get you. So that's the top news of today. Ikari is planning to stay with Inter. Hmm, that's weird. Uh, they, they have all the news, bro. And Ronaldo is the future of Juventus, according to Allegri. Because people started talking. But Ronaldo wanted to leave next year if they don't win the Champions League because he's there for the Champions League, okay? And also, Barcelona is targeting uh, Richard Lisson. I think that's his name. Hopefully, I'm not lying. There you go. I got the name right. So, yeah, all the transfer news, all the injuries, all the gossip in world football, everything here is here. And also, Soldier is starting to get angry. <laughs> he said, Some Manchester United players need a reality check. So, yeah, guys, go download the app. The link will be in the description. It's free. And it helps my channel out, so go do that. Transfer wise, they have Malcolm. Why are you going to me now? Say we don't know yet. Shoes, blah blah blah. Go check it out for yourself. Also, games are on the other you know side of it. Tomorrow, there's Man City and Tottenham. Big game. 
the next day, Everton uh, versus Man United. What I like about this is you could follow, just like on social media, you could follow some clubs and players and you get their news rapido. What? For example, I'm following Adebayo, Cristiano Ronaldo, Togo, Man United, Barcelona, all those clubs, and they are the ones that I get their news first, okay? There's following and there's all games. So I get the news, fixtures, and blah 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 transfer of the clubs I follow. But if I want, I can see everybody's stuff. And also, you don't need to be on this app 24 7. You could just turn on the notification in the app, and anytime there's something major coming, boom! You get hit with the news. They notify you instantly. So yeah, guys, the link will be in the description for one football. Go download it. You know, check it out. And you know why I'm saying it's the best app in the world. Okay, I count on you. Go do it. It's time to get deep, ladies and gentlemen. We have here a FIFA 20 concept of career mode. You guys know I started enjoying career mode lately. I'm doing some career mode, you know, series, blah blah blah. We have Dominic Drexel again. I think it's the same guy who designed the Hazard screen start. Now he's bringing us some career mode. Let's see how he got what he got going on, okay? Hmm, the whole thing is red. I mean, it makes sense because Hazard is on the cover and we saw that the, 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 the star screen was red. Over here, he's talking about, okay, it's Chelsea, okay. Uh, is it too red for me? Probably. Probably too red, like it's too, I don't know how to explain it. It's too big, like too, too tense. You know, the red is too deep, okay? But let's focus on the the add the additions there, etc. We have central squad transfer. Uh transfer was there. Hmm, okay. Inbox. Inbox I was there. Training. Yeah. Youth team office. Alright. Nothing special here yet. Uh youth development. Okay. I think that's new. He added that. Personal training. I think that's new too. Uh visual visual sim. I don't think it's part of the career mode we have right now, so that's new. Uh, they have like, <laughs> I don't know how to call it. They have footage, actual real life footage of players talking about transfers. I think that's a little bit of a reach, because what if, I don't know, Birmingham City want to buy Ronaldo, I don't think there's going to be footage of that. But they could find a way to finesse it, to be honest, they could find a way to finesse it. It's not a bad thing. Uh, apart from that, I don't think he added anything major to it, to be honest. But let's let's take a look at it. He didn't add anything major. Uh, he's gonna enter something. Hopefully, hopefully that's something else because right now, I don't see anything special apart from the youth development. The visual scene, I like it because sometimes you could be playing, uh, you could be simulating a game and jump in to make a change or, you know, play the game, finish it yourself. So I think that's a good add to the thing. But yeah, apart from that, that's it, man. Look at Frankie the Young talking about his multi That would be dope. That would be dope. I'm not gonna lie. That would be dope. Okay, guys, over here we have F Mac GFX who designed a FIFA 20 cover. Okay, do I agree with the cover? It's Modric and Neymar. The cover looks nice, it's blueish, brother. But I don't agree with the players on it. Modric, not a good season at all. Neymar injured. So it doesn't make sense, in my opinion, it doesn't. We're taking a look at another career mode, okay? And this one is like, there's a lot of details in this, okay? Central squad transfer finances, office season, and my club. My club wasn't there. I don't think so. Going to transfer alone, okay? By the way, this was done by Mr. Uh, what is his name? Infinity by Kyo. You know, I'm trying to give credit to everybody. I'm not stealing nobody's creation. We have transfer budget, simulate transfers, that's not in FIFA 19. Manage transfer staff, scouting assignments, search players, objectives. Um, I don't think there's like transfer objectives in transfers, this FIFA no. And then there's transfer history, transfer hub. So over here, so far we have transfer budget, I think. Uh, simulating transfer, which is new. What else? Uh, and oh, okay, sponsors. Okay, sponsors are back. Hopefully, FIFA 20. Like, let's say you need money. Boom, you can sign a deal with you sign a deal with Jeep. Who's gonna give them 17 million dollars a year? Hey, for four years, that's a lot of money. Okay, that's a lot of money. And stuff like that could increase your shirt sales, currently bringing in commercial ads. That's good. Also, they say you could request funds. That is really good. If you're watching my career mode on with Chelsea right now, you could notice that I was struggling. The, the club had no more money. 
if this you know was in FIFA 19 I could request some funds and they give me money and boom we back on track but it's not FIFA 19 so I really really like this Mr. Uh, Infinity by Kyo this is nice especially the request found and the sponsor that alone we need that something everybody could agree with me on that we need in FIFA 20 <laughs> trade offers ladies and gentlemen over here on the screen you can see Mr. Harrison uh, design is trying to you know use Salah and maybe that's want to watch Mbappe to get icons in that bro you have to you have to bro you have to add trade offers in this game like I don't understand Zidane is needed in FIFA 20 like that's a boss I don't I don't I don't I don't care what he is even if they only have to add one icon only one make it Zidane that's all I want that's all I need in my life and my life is safe but yeah man if you guys know what transfer uh, trade offer is you could you and your friend you know somebody your friend with on the Xbox or PS4 or whatever y'all could trade in players you give them some of your players and they give you some of the players you want it's between y'all okay but you remove them you know the trade offer because of coin series I know I understand where they're coming from but at the same time I feel like they could find a way to finesse it like we could still have trade offers but they could they could still you know shit on coin sponsors you know like they, they need to find a way they need to find a way because this is dope and yes I'll accept the, the, the offer I want my that all right, over here, Luca did a FIFA 20 card concept, like you know the card design. Ah, uh, it's decent, nothing really special though. But let's take a look at the ratings. Pogba got an 88, I think it's okay, you know. He was 87 uh, this year, so he got upgraded. Do you guys think Pogba deserves an upgrade this year? He, his, his season was like this, bro, <laughs> like this, on and off. But at the end of the day, I think he scored like maybe 15 goals or something like that so far. I think he deserves, I think it's one upgrade, okay? Definitely not a downgrade, definitely not a downgrade. I won't be shocked if he's still the same rating. Messi, 94, his pace got downgraded, dribbling, still dope, shooting, I think he got upgraded, if I'm not mistaken. Passing, he's still dope, I hope I'm not mistaken. Sancho got upgraded, you know, rightfully so, he, he's having a dope season. Different card concept, okay? This one is done by Food Station. The silver one, Probably my favorite. It's just beautiful, like some diamond. Okay, the gold one is nice too. You have King on it. If King comes on, you know, FIFA 20 with a new card, probably gonna be, you know, this rating, probably 80, 82, something, you know, low key like that. Then progressively, you get upgraded. Uh, the bronze one is decent too. This, this is a nice, it's a nice, you know, card. I, I won't mind it. Another one, but this I think is the same. It's not the same. This is Cube FIFA. Another designer, uh, and he did red players, you know, full champion players, e forms, and then team on the season. Hmm. It's not bad though. It's really not bad. Like when you think about it, I actually like it. I don't think if I, uh, I don't know. I'm trying to see is the team on the season one good or bad. I'm in the middle. I'm trying to say it's good, but at the same time, like, mm, it's still really good. Hmm. Whatever. The card design decent. I think we could we could get something like this though. Here might hit us with something like this. Like the boots at the bottom as well makes it nice. I think they could hit us with something like this. Another car design and probably my favorite. I'm not gonna lie. I like the way the the the, the it, okay. What I'm trying to say is like we probably have something like this before. Okay, probably in FIFA 18. But this time they have something in the back. It's like the FIFA 18 card is leaning on another card. So it's like double the the imagery. It looks nice. Varan is a Beast. Imagine if it comes to money United. Oh man, goddamn. Well, you know, Zidane is, is with Real Madrid now, so mm, all those French players, I don't think they probably leave. I don't think they're gonna leave uh, Real Madrid. I doubt it. But if Varane comes to Money United, it's, it's a big plus. It is a big plus. He starts a sick. Uh, Zidane, though, I mean, I need him, bro. I need him in FIFA 20. I don't, I don't care. I don't care what it costs. I need him. Mbappe apparently is going to Real Madrid. According to some people, we will see. We don't show, we will see. But this is probably my favorite card design so far. Uh, I like it. I like the double card. Did they copy each other? Because this is another designer, okay? His name is Simon Design. And the designs look pretty much the same as what we just seen right now from Cube FIFA, I think. You know, uh, probably a FIFA 19 design. 
but leaning on another car design in the back. They have Pepe, Mbappe and Lala all got upgraded. Shout out to Pepe who's having a stupid season. Okay, he's killing. I think he's on like 20 goals or something like that. It's mad. Mbappe, it's Mbappe, so he's gonna get upgraded. Nelly retained, a lot of pace, a lot of dribbling, shooting, physical is decent. Uh, Lala, dope defender too, especially in FIFA. Like, everybody loves using him, so he got upgraded. Pace is there, physical is there, defender is there. I like the stats. This guy, I think he got the stats on point. Simon Design, good job. I like your design as well. And last thing we're looking at today is another concept card. But this guy, uh, his name is Harrison Hasurus. He got everything set up for us, okay? One to watch. Icon, E4, bronze, silver, gold. They are there. Which one is your favorite out of this, okay? I think the gold card looks sick, bro. The gold card looks sick. The icon card, I think the brightness is a little bit too much on the face of Mbappe. Apart from that, dope, dope card, bro, dope cards. I like the gold card a lot. There's like this little, you know, straight line that's dropping. It's kind of thick and it's going through the foot, you know, 20 thing in the background. I like it, I like it. Mbappe base got upgraded apparently. Like it's just too fast. Too fast. But yeah, guys, we covered a lot of things today about FIFA 20. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Every year I do this video, share it with friends so you can see what people in the community are kind of you know putting together for the next FIFA. Hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know in the comment section what's missing. I'll say probably FIFA Street. Uh and that's it, bro. Something for pro clubs. You know, I don't play for pro clubs, but people that play it need something new. Okay, yeah, please do it. I love you guys and I'll catch you later. Don't forget to go download one of the link will be in the description. Take care. Gang!